Hello, I'm Martin Fenska and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Civilization V as China. So we are still at war with Arabia, but we have to end the war as soon as possible because we have to start preparations for war with the Incas. In the previous episode, or in the end of the previous episode, I said that I would uh, uh, try to figure out way how to shut them down as soon as possible but uh, since we accepted the coalition of friendship uh, it probably won't be that easy so my plan against uh, pachacute will be actually quite simple uh, wait for penicillin get submarines build uh, some submarine fleet and uh, just destroy his navy with submarines subs are extremely effective against all surface ships especially um ships from uh, like all the eras everything that uh, or all the ships that are before uh before submarines so modern era and earlier uh, should die in like one hit maybe two hits when it comes to like ironclads but um, still a lot more effective than surface ships so hopefully thanks to subs we'll be able to uh, get rid of uh, his whole navy that is getting a little bit scary so this is the plan and thanks to the declaration of friendship we hopefully have enough time to build up uh, this uh, submarine fleet and everything easily i think we have like seven to turns at least for the declaration of friendship still so that um, should uh give us some time before he even starts thinking about attacking us because it would be quite uh, annoying if he decided to attack before we are ready so maybe the declaration of friendship is not that uh, bad after all but enough talking let's uh get to the game how does it look like here yeah we want all these cities especially medina uh, but Let's reset a bit. Heal. Uh, heal, heal. Wait, heal. Uh, we first have to grab Pandormus. Okay, now we can end it. No, I don't want to declare war on him. Come on, keep moving. Everyone, go. Go. You can go. Uh, you can go somewhere for now, and uh, you as well. I'm just trying to prevent going through Arabian territory. Okay, now we can finally end the turn. Um, I hope this Fusilier survives, because we really need to plunder the Citadel. Okay, another city is gone. Or gone. Uh, another city captured by Pachakuti. But there was something I noticed. Yeah, here, to the south, it seems that uh, Arabia, I mean Arabia, Mongolia somehow managed to start sieging, sieging Attico. Well, we'll see if they can do anything, but I don't think so. They're just being destroyed everywhere. Okay, what did we get? City connection and some growth. I guess we could use more food. And how does it look like here? Um, we could try to speed up the scientist a little bit. 36 to 27. Yeah, I think I'm willing to do that. And maybe when we get the scientist, if I still remember, I will switch some scientists into engineers and try to speed up the engineer as well. Oh, and we got another ironclad. Maybe I should have grabbed that medic, but well, too late for that. Uh, where is Austria here? But yeah, <laughs> minus 100 gold per turn. Don't think that we'll be trading with them any soon. Uh, 
player choice. Okay, I think I will have to move a unit before we can check this thing. I'm clicking on that, but it's not doing anything. And I should be able to forest the game. There we go. Warfare. This might be pretty useful. Morale promotion, plus five happiness for 90 turns. Eh. Plus three production in all cities is not as amazing as it is in the early game. You can get warfare very early and then plus three production in all cities is crazy good. This late, it's still okay, but not as amazing. We love the king day. We have that everywhere. This would give us extra time, but we are now getting so many um, great works that probably doesn't matter. We don't have any academies. I mean, military academies, of course. I think I'll still go for the production. I'm really not a big fan of the first one. Yeah, let's just grab some more production. Also, with the amount of cities we have and all cities working on the uh, World's Fair, this may speed it up a little bit. Look at that, we contributed 14,000. 800 and the project is still on only still only on 48 percent probably no one else is building it but well let's just keep working on it we just have to finish it as soon as possible and then we can resume work on something else if we don't finish it no one else would most likely okay can we get the city on this turn no I don't think so at least they managed to kill that camel archer so what else um, you will definitely build me a village and the caravan will keep feeding the capital that's still fine also off camera I upgraded some units uh, you will probably see which ones here we have two zeppelins so let's send them to the front line. Oh, where? Let's send them here. That's one. And the other one as well. Now the musket man. I can upgrade this one again. Same here. These are units that I'll use in case we get some barbarians or some random units that uh, moves into our territory. We have a few of these scattered around the uh, around the, our cities, so we can afford these upgrades now. So that's why I'm doing it. Uh, let's upgrade the garrisons as well. At least all the ranged units and the iron clod. Hmm. Let's get vision here. I want to see if there are some uh, Incan ships around these new cities. Wow, look at these envoys. Yeah, that'll be the biggest problem when we declare on Pachacuti because you'll end up fighting probably all the city-states. That'll be really annoying. Okay, here... I think we can build another village. You will wait. You definitely need the healing. And now on this side, where did this frigate come? I mean, frigate Corvette came from. Two, four. One, two, there we go. Well, 
let's grab the city finally. Two, three. Come on, don't tell me that we don't have the damage. What is this? Uh, visibility range. No, probably movement. One more attack. And we have two more attacks here. Okay, good. That will be... Where is it here? Another puppet. Or oh, let me check the city. Well, it's not bad. But I will puppet it for now. Once we are done with this war, I'll have to decide what we are gonna do with all these new cities. Problem is... I may have to grab Damascus as well. There's just not enough room for all the units that I want to... Uh, that I want to use for the second war. Could I just move in? Maybe oh, there's Camel Archer. Uh, <clears throat> there's another one. Maybe this was a bit too early. Okay, what else? We can get a mine here. Could move north. Heal, heal. I'm afraid that I may lose the city. I can't do anything about it, anything at all. Maybe I could try to send this guy. No. Same problem all the time. So where do we go now? Vienna is about to fall. So we probably should stay in this area. Now, go. Yep. Oh, this is annoying. We just lost an ironclad. I'll have to move in with some units before I can capture the city. Uh, can we get something else? I think I'll just get the gold. And Austria is gone completely. That didn't take long. Okay. So I hope that uh, Pachakuti now moves his units south so they're not in the way and maybe attacks these cities. But it'll be fun when he captures all the remaining cities and basically runs out of target. Then he either declares on Arabia or he declares on us. Oh. Okay, let's go for the mission. It's not much, but well. How does it look like with the influence? How is it possible we didn't get influence? Hmm. I didn't really read the description of the diplomatic mission, but I thought there was uh, also some influence. Well, there definitely wouldn't be enough to get over 403, so whatever. Oh, 
Oh no. Wait. We still don't have the city. It's too early for healing. Two, three, four. One more turn after this. Damn, this is slow. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, we gonna need one ironclad here to recapture the city. Oh, we can't build a village here. We have one right next to it. Okay, so in that case, it's gonna be a farm. Fortify, fortify, fortify. Uh, same here. You can move north as well, I guess. And uh, here we can just get some more experience. Kill some units. Yeah, looks good. And you can probably move back, heal. Uh, can we kill this guy? I think we can. There we go. Maybe for now we can work the seaport and first get a landmark here before we lock the lock the tile. Okay, let's get a bank here. Bank probably into public school, then into factory, or oh, we are fine. There's not much crime here, so we don't need the castle. Well, factory, opera house, observatory, probably something like that. And I wanted to buy a ship here. So that's gonna be a cruiser. And that will help us get rid of these barbarians. Okay, um, move. So can we trade something? Truffles. Maybe even trade aluminum to him. We don't need it and we won't need it for a while. And he doesn't need it, so is he willing to pay? Uh, not really. Who else has some money? We just got some resources back when Austria disappeared from the map, so... Uh, you know what? Let's get like a thousand here. Or maybe... 818 will be enough. Thank you. I think this will be all that we can do. Maybe... We're already selling everything we can to Carthage. What we could do though... Sell her... Let's see, 
architecture. Get the dies from her. And a little bit of gold per turn. 120. And 450, something like this. Okay, go. Oh. Uh, this tile definitely is not range of any city, so we can uh, get an artifact here. And this one, uh, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, is also out of range. So this is gonna be. We don't have ink and artifacts yet, we can grab one. Yes, please. Okay, just keep moving. And you are definitely safe. How much damage can we do? Oh, yeah, sure, why not? And you know what? Let's send this Fusilier north as well. We need to get to the city as soon as possible. Uh, where was that? Um, no. That would mean a war with Incas if I accepted that. But for some reason we took quite a lot of damage. And I'm not sure why. And where did this corvette come from? They can't go this way. It was here, two, four. Can they really go this far? No, they can't. They have to be coming from here. Or maybe I just didn't see it. That's also possible. die okay hope it's safe now the problem is because uh, we had to flip the city uh, it's gonna be significantly worse now yeah, there are no buildings here left. Hmm. I'll probably return it to Arabia eventually because the city is really bad now. You know, thinking about capturing Karakorum. I probably don't have the damage to take the city. It will take forever. Nah, I'll we'll just kill some more units. One. Two, three. So that's that. And, well, we probably won't be able to kill the Camel Archer, right? He'll just... No, he didn't retreat. Good. Okay, some more targets. Hmm.
hope it's enough now that we can capture the city. Uh, so let's see, is it enough? It should be. Of course not. Ah, oh, come on. That kill on that Lancer was still a little bit too greedy. I should have attacked the city instead. Oh well. Next turn. Fortify. Wait. Keep healing. Sure, the tile will be upgraded soon <clears throat> or improved soon so we can lock it and here how fast are we growing we probably need that food uh, 32 turns for engineer though how fast 26 and we delay the growth only by two turns this might be better And did I really send all the units from Amsterdam? Um, I didn't want to do that. I just noticed that there are no units now. Okay, probably should send at least a few. That's one. And let's send this guy as well. Go. It will take a while, but hopefully uh, but I could have won't attack in the next like 12 turns. Next. Okay, this should be another artifact. Yep. And this will be a mine. How did we drop to six? Unhappiness. How did we get 70 war weariness from fl flipping one city? Wow. Okay, I, I think it's time to end the war. Well. Remember for the next war, don't flip cities, no matter what. And where are these units coming from? Um, what can we get now? Broadside. And if I don't move out of here, He'll be trapped. Dude, we are friends now, right? Can we get open borders, please? Thank you. Actually, wait, no, open borders. I want open borders from you. Ah, oh, it solves our problem. Now we can move our units into position easily. Good. Yeah, thank you. Uh, let's try to get a few kills still. How much money do we have? 15,000. Can we buy a tile maybe? Now we can probably afford to do it so that we, or that all the people do something. Guys, we'll have to wait a while. Okay, 
Okay, that's another unit. They'll move towards Amsterdam. could use a farm here let's get back there quickly do we have some workers around here that can do something now when we are not fighting Anton and Eva anymore we can move this guy oh another great admiral good Now the question is, where do we need him? Can we move him to Carthage? Oh, I don't think so. We can move him to Istanbul. That's not gonna help. move him to this area okay let's move him to new sarai i'm just surprised that we can't move him to Carthage, or it's also possible that i'm just blind and don't see it no here is Carthage. yeah that'll be better Forty-five. Two, four, five, that's perfect. Now, I'm a bit afraid to do this because the unhappiness surprised me a little bit. Um, I can't view the city. Never mind, I'll just create a puppet. And it's time to talk about peace now. I can't afford to stay at war with this war weariness. So, Arabia. Let's talk about peace. What can we get from this? A lot. The value is 56,000. Can we? It's probably impossible. But what about some cities like Medina? Perfect. We don't have to. Uh, we don't have to capture it. We can just get it as the part of the peace deal. And I think. Actually, let me check the map again. One, two, three. Now, when we get Medina. You won't get cut off because we will have access here but we could get a cut off here if he just gets this tile then we are screwed and we probably can't get Arden as the as a part of this peace deal right Medina. and the other one was then yeah that's not gonna happen. Well, I guess we just take one city. We can grab first, we can grab salt, that's for sure. What about cotton or silk? Nope. I guess just money. I want to get cash, 2000. No, 2,000. Oh, come on. There. And... That's too much. 120. Uh, 118. 117. Oh, 17. Okay. Looks good to me. Hope I didn't forget about something, but... Uh, 
I don't think so. Um, which one is this? Medina, right? So it's going to be another puppet for now. Look at the unhappiness. Oh, it's scary. But we should lose the war weariness now very quickly. So that's going to solve the problem. Let's play one more turn because I want to see what happens with the uh, war weariness. And then I'll play off camera a bit because I'll have to first figure out where I want all the units and then I'll have to move them there. So at least I'll give the orders for the units to move. That's gonna take a while and. Uh, yeah, when that's done, I'll start recording again. Uh, 45. And... Go. Also, I'll have to decide about all the cities that we now got. What are we gonna do with them? Oh, and I should have... Grabbed a few more things. We definitely want embassy, and we want open borders, so that we can move our units through his borders to prepare for his destruction. Uh, yes, and I think, because he's now very happy that he's still alive. We can get some nice trade here. I'm even thinking about just trading him with technology. Because like architecture really won't give him much, but uh, we take away significant portion of his income and that should hurt him he won't be able to upgrade units and you know all the things like that i'm even thinking about giving him acoustics as well and just grab 260 acceptable how much is he making 262 okay let's take away all his money Good. So, during the next war, there really shouldn't be any upgraded units, maybe like one or two. And that's what I want. I want his military to be behind. Oh, and we are on our unit cap. How did that happen? Uh, war weariness again. All the reductions for every card because of the negative happiness. Come on, come on, come on. Let's get rid of the war weariness. Solve this problem. There we go. That's better. And yeah, in two or three turns the war weariness will be gone. And for the next war we have to remember that uh, we really can't afford to flip cities. I didn't expect that it would be so bad just after flipping a city once. Some connections. Oh, no longer strategic monopoly. How did that happen? Because you lost the mine somewhere, I think. Well, I'll have to check all of this off camera. 
because it will take a while. And how does this look like? 85% almost done. But this was an expensive project. Hmm. Where is that coal that we lost? Here. How long would it take? Four turns? Okay, I'll just wait. But this will be all for this episode. As I said, I will play a little bit off camera, like a turn or two. Uh, so the situation will look a bit different on the start of the next episode. But I won't do anything really important and there shouldn't be any wars or anything. So yeah, just uh, the logistics. And as usual, I hope that you like this episode. I hope that you're going to join me for the next one again. And until then, have a good time. Bye-bye. Mm -hmm.